Kia ora guys, Dave here, Dave3126, uh, Kiwi guy from New Zealand, um, doing reaction videos. Uh, this one is um, Sarah Milliken, <laughs> and I watched one of her ones earlier on, and she was pretty funny. Um, and I know there's probably going to be swearing and stuff involved in this one, and if it's a dirty weekend away, there's got to be some great stuff. So, let's watch it. Really even girlfriend and boyfriend it was really early days in our relationship we decided to go away on a dirty weekend give us a cheer if you've ever been on a dirty weekend it's a lot of you but there will be more of you but you will have just realized that it wasn't with the person you're sitting beside <laughs> on a dirty weekend I didn't know what sorts of things you're supposed to take let's get some suggestions from you guys let's start at the top because that worked well last time anybody in the top level want to shout out what you think you take on a dirty god I haven't even finished the fucking sentence <laughs> there's a lady said handcuffs what kind of handcuffs furry furry, furry. Oh. Yes. there was last time I was I was working in Newcastle a lady was on this level and she shouted out handcuffs like that and I said, oh, have you got the heavy-duty ones or the fluffy ones? And she said, I'm not telling you that. I'm sitting beside me, ma'am. <laughs> you still shouted out fucking handcuffs. <laughs> it was the fella the other day shouted out a bag of lube. And I was like, I'm pretty sure it comes in a tube. <laughs> I imagined it being like an Asda bag for life. And he just dipped himself in every now and again. <laughs> Anybody else upstairs want to shout? A rabbit. Oh, oh, sorry. I thought for a minute I was like, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. like, That's I what I was Tottenham, thinking. And three people shouted out rabbit one after the other. And I thought, fucking hell, Chaz and Dave are in. <laughs> Next level down, up a circle. Anybody got a suggestion what you take on a dirty weekend? Little beads. Hey, where are you? Where's, hello, flower, anal beads. <laughs> wow. Have you, have you, have you? Why am I whispering? I'm in the microphone. <laughs> Nobody else is listening, Flower. Have you got anal beads? I've got plenty of things. <laughs> okay. I've got loads of things. I've got, you know, handbag and that. <laughs> is that the most extreme thing you've got, love? No. no. <laughs> Didn't think it was. Now tell me about anal beads. Uh. They go up your arsehole. I figured that bit out myself. <laughs> Can you still wear them as jewellery after that, though? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Just make sure you've always got brown earrings and then you're fine. <laughs> Anybody else in the top two sections? Willy warmers. A willy warmer. <laughs> Why is it going to be so cold? <laughs> <laughs> I feel sad for the willy, do you? I mean, there is some way you could keep it warm, love. <laughs> that's not an offer. Fuck, that sounded like a date. <laughs> uh, why would you take a willy warmer, love? A man's always cold. Mine's always cold. <laughs> <laughs> Have you tried just giving it a good roll? <laughs> oh. Let's come down the, the uh, grand circle, anybody? A cucumber. A cucumber? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, I'm not taking salad. <laughs> anybody else in this middle section? Cake, where are you, love? <laughs> now you're fucking talking. <laughs> <laughs> now, is the cake for eating or like for... I was going to... I don't know what that was. <laughs> I was going to say smearing, but that feels like a really bad word. Smearing. Is the cake for smearing or for eating, love? Everything. Or oh, a little bit of both. I like that. There was a lady the other day who said chocolate body paint. And I said, well, only if I can paint it on my palms and lick it off myself because I'm not fucking sharing. <laughs> <laughs> no, you stay where you are, love. <laughs> <laughs> It's definitely you making me do those noises. Oh my. <laughs> there was another lady shouting, shout again, love. A Bread. A friend. <laughs> <laughs> Bread. <laughs> it was a, a couple of 
weeks ago, somebody shouted out, creme fraiche, and I thought, ooh. <laughs> and then when I got off stage, she sent me a message on Twitter saying, no, I said femme fresh. Oh. <laughs> Anybody else in that section? A ball gag. A ball gag? <laughs> That's something you haven't got, isn't it, love? <laughs> there was a lady, a lady said, bondage gear. And I said, do you tie your partner up or does your partner tie you up? And she said, I tie him up and then I fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Stuff to the pub. Now let's do the, the, the rest of the boxes. And anybody downstairs got a suggestion what you take on a dirty weekend? What was that? Blowtorch. Hold on, hold on. A what? <laughs> a blow. Did you really say a blowtorch? <laughs> <laughs> In case you fancied a creme brulee. <laughs> <laughs> and was there another one over here? Via, where's the Viagra? Where did you... That you there? Oh, how you doing? You all right, love? <laughs> Is that, does that work for you? That's how she was made. <laughs> Has she just found out as okay. well? <laughs> oh, look at her. She's mortified. <laughs> so is it... Lovely girl, hello. Is it good to know that your dad had a proper all weekend? <laughs> Two nights in a row. <laughs> what about the bit like the daytime? Is it like that through the day as well? Or you know, how do you get your clothes on? <laughs> you just push it down and then does it like boy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always disappointed they don't do that noise. Boy. <laughs> 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 It was Butlins. <laughs> Viagra at Butlins. <laughs> Sounds like a Mills and Boone, doesn't it? <laughs> it was the lady said, uh, crotchless pants. And I thought, well, I've often got a hole in, but it's never in the right place. <laughs> but it, one thing you've forgotten as well is you, if you're going to take your rabbit, if you, you're going to take your, uh, you're going to take batteries. You've got to take spare batteries because you don't want uh, to turn into wow, wow. <laughs> All I'm doing now is stirring it. <laughs> I rang my fella uh, before we went away oh and I said to him, I've been to family planning. And he must have thought, this isn't going to be sexy at all. I said, I've got some condoms, because I'd heard they were free there, and I love a bargain. <laughs> and he said, well, that's good, that's good. I said, I've got 36, do you think that'll be enough? <laughs> and quick as a flash, he just went, well, you can leave 32 of them at home. <laughs> and I thought, that's still four, though, isn't it? And he went, we'll use two of those for water balloons. <laughs> it's good to know that he had activities planned, though. Hi, I'm Sarah Millican, and thanks very much for watching my video. I'm on tour at the moment with a show called Bobby Dazzler. To find out where I'm going and when, go to sarahmillican.co.uk. Thanks. Bye. Well worth the watch. Um, that was pretty funny. Uh, so if you haven't seen it or seen any of your other videos, just click on the link below and, um, yeah, enjoy. Um, if you've got any other ideas on what I should watch or could watch, um, just hit me up, let me know. But uh, thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time. Cheers.